Who doesn't love asparagus? I'm going to show you two simple pairings that I'm sure your family will really enjoy and it's very quick and easy. First of all, to trim the asparagus, you can either cut off the very bottom like that or you can even hold it um, like this at the very end and just give it a snap and it'll naturally snap off right where you want to trim it. So um, we're going to next blanch our asparagus in boiling salted water and the salt will really set the color and keep it nice and bright green. You can also steam them if you prefer to do that either way. Uh, but I'm, I love blanching. So in they go and they're going to cook for about a minute or so. The thinner the stalk, the less time. All right, we want these nice and crisp tender, so let's remove them from the boiling water. They look great. Okay, we're gonna put them all over here and turn off your heat. All right, now let's find a nice looking platter to put these on. All right, wanna do this while they're still very, very hot. So since I'm showing you two ways to do this, let's divide this in two. You can serve it this way if you want or one or the other, whichever you prefer. All right, here we have our cooked asparagus. Now with one, I'm going to top with a little bit of Bernays butter. Um, this is all natural, unsalted butter, and the primary ingredient that gives this flavor is tarragon, fresh tarragon. It's a wonderful ingredient. Remember, just a little bit goes a long way. This will melt on top of the hot um, asparagus. Or here's another way. We can drizzle very lightly with your favorite extra virgin olive oil. In Italy, they sometimes say that a little bit of olive oil makes the vegetables go down. So an olive oil that has a lot of flavor, like the Sicilian extra virgin olive oil, is a great choice. Now for a finishing touch, I like to put on a little bit of fresh lemon juice, but add it at the very end, because if you add it too soon, it'll really blanch out the color from the asparagus. Um, now maybe just a little bit of freshly ground black pepper. You can use that on both sides. And maybe a little bit of salt on this side because the Bernays butter already has a lot of seasoning in it. There you go. You've got asparagus two ways in less than two minutes.